in verse 23, and be renewed in the spirit of your mind and, verse 24, that you put on the new man, which after God is created in righteousness and true holiness. Now, I just quoted this a minute ago. But notice he says, this, now notice, this is something for you to do. You have to do this. He says you are to put off, number one, he says you have to be renewed in the spirit of your mind. So this means that there is some effort some something directed toward you changing the spirit of your mind. That means you have to have your mind renewed to the word of God, right? But now then he says, and you put off the old man, the old lifestyle, and put on the new man. And how do you do that? Well, tell me, what is this new man like? Well, he was recreated in righteousness and true holiness after the image of Jesus, who is the image of God. So there is a choice you make and a thing you do that when you catch yourself doing what you used to do or thinking the way you used to think, that you take those thoughts captive, and we're going to look at that, but you take those thoughts captive and you go, no, this is the truth. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do this. And then you replace that with this and you do it until this becomes the way you normally do things. That is a process in your life. You do it. God doesn't do it for you. He will help you if you ask him to. But he will not force you to do anything. But you can rely on his strength to get it done, and you can start renewing your mind. But let me tell you, this is not an overnight thing. It's like I you know, posted on Facebook even this weekend, is that most people want, they want to come to church, and in you know, 30 minutes, they want to get a problem solved that took them 30 years to develop. Well, can God do that? Of course he can. But once he does his part and does that change and fixes that problem, now you've got to live like that problem's fixed and live from then on. You can't go back living and thinking and talking about the problem as though it's still a problem. You have to actually have to change your mouth, you have to change your thoughts, and you have to change your actions to line up with whatever happens in the service. 